what's going on guys thank you so much for tuning in to another video in today's video we're going to install something that i absolutely always wanted for any of the cars that i had and that is a wireless apple carplay i don't know about you guys but i absolutely hate fun doodling around with the cables inside the car um especially with apple carplay we have to connect it and disconnect it sometimes and it gets really annoying this right here is gonna eliminate that for you all you have to do is just connect it via bluetooth and you have apple carplay on your phone without having any cables this one in particular is from one car stereo and it's called the ai box light and it's super small i'll just show you guys right now all right so we got the box right here let's get this opened up and get it all set up all right so we got we got some instructions got some instructions and this is it right here look how small this is this thing is super tiny which is perfect for a bluetooth carplay you could put it anywhere you could attach it anywhere it's perfect this comes with the actual piece here let's put this to the side and we got a usb and a little dongle here as well so let's get this all set up okay in order for us to connect the little box we need to plug in this usb port that came with it into the port that has the carplay so this is the one that has the carplay in my car we're going to plug that in and now we're going to connect the actual device okay so we got the actual device connected here now let's go ahead and connect it to my phone okay so we got that plugged in now all we have to do is just connect it to bluetooth so let's turn on bluetooth and it should pop up right here there it is and it should connect okay so prompted us here to use carplay we're going to go ahead and select use carplay let's see what this does bam so go straight to carplay look at that how cool is this guys no cables nothing and we got apple carplay now i have to know that this is not the actual actual carplay it may seem like it but it's like a third party but it works exactly like carplay like there is no lag i mean obviously even with regular carplay like there's slight lag but this thing works awesome and it would work like any regular carplay and what's also cool is that if you shut off the car and then right as you get in you start the truck It might take a minute, but it automatically connects to your phone. There you go. Now, another thing is if you guys wanted to like watch Netflix or YouTube, you could also do that on this as well. You press on the screen this little square comes up you click on that and you click on this little green arrow and then we have apps we have netflix um i think there's a couple other apps you could add on but for now uh let's try youtube so we can watch youtube on here now in order to watch you need to be connected to a network obviously i mean the truck doesn't have built-in wi-fi i mean that would be pretty cool but what I'm going to do is I'm going to just connect my personal hotspot. I'm going to turn on my personal hotspot. And we're going to go ahead and connect that. So let's go back to that main menu. We go to settings. We're going to go to more settings. And we're going to go network and Wi-Fi. So we got Wi-Fi right here. So let's go ahead and connect that it's automatically already connecting to my hotspot sweet now we're connected now let's go back to the youtube app 
my YouTube is probably going to be really slow right now because I have terrible service where I'm at. But if we are going to go ahead and search our favorite YouTube channel, it works just like Apple, which is pretty cool. Might take a couple tries. There it goes. Yeah, like I said, I have terrible service here. Um, if you guys have better hotspot that's not <clears throat> at and then uh, it might work better for you, but I just have bad hotspot. Okay, so we searched our favorite YouTube channel. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And we click on our favorite YouTube channel. And it's super slow, obviously, because of the place I'm at. But yeah, look at that. We're on YouTube. Um, if you guys haven't seen my rebuilding of this Tacoma from auction, I encourage you to check that out. And there you go. Obviously, yeah, like I said, it's going to be a little laggy right now because of where I'm at. But we're just watching YouTube on our truck. I'm super excited for this. I do a lot of road trips and a lot of um, different driving from different cities and areas. And this is gonna be perfect for off-roading and camping as well for the long drives. Super excited for this. Check this out. How cool is that? Sweet. All right, guys, and that's going to do it. I'm super excited for this. I can't wait to use it. Um, definitely worth it, in my opinion, especially if you hate playing around with the cables. And then I don't know how often I'm actually going to use, like, the Netflix and the YouTube stuff. I mean, for long road trips, it's definitely nice. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, when you do that, make sure you're driving safe. But if you guys are interested in this, the link is going to be in the description. Uh, they have this for i believe any car that has apple carplay features um, i'm sure if you get a, go on their website they'll specify exactly which one you need hope you guys enjoyed this quick little install i know it's different from me actually rebuilding the truck and don't worry the lift kit the wheels the off-roading everything's coming soon we just gotta get a couple little things out of the way to make this truck a little bit more comfortable and a little bit a little bit more personable to my liking and for uh, my everyday lifestyle here. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.